Hello friends, welcome to Creative Zone. In this video, I'm going to explain current classifications. In my previous video, I told you direction of electron flow, but this time I'm going to explain current classifications, which are AC and DC. AC stands for alternating current and DC stands for direct current. In DC circuit, electrons flow only one direction. But in AC circuit, electrons change their flow direction. Now question is, what about the voltage? Very simple. In DC circuit, voltage push electrons through the circuit in one way. I mean one direction. Now what about AC voltage? This time voltage also change electron push direction. I am giving a simple example to clear it. See this circuit. Here I am using just a power source and a lamp. Ok, obviously this is DC power source. Now focus on this circuit. See, electrons are flowing on the one direction. Here electron flow are conventional current rule doesn't fact. Just see electrons are flowing one direction and lamp glowing ok same circuit i'm changing the power source dc to ac oops did you notice the direction of electron flow they are going forward and backward forward and backward as a result lamp blinking oh my god it look like an auto switch on off on off on off on off blah 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 ok no it's not ok actually here's a doubt we are using ac power in our house but our ac lamp doesn't blink what the hell why okay actually alternating current has frequency i mean constant frequency which is 50 or 60 hertz now what is 50 or 60 hertz actually 50 hertz mean current changes direction 100 time that mean 50 cycles per second on the other hand 60 hertz mean current changes direction 120 time i mean 60 cycles per second. Now think, if AC lamp blinks 120 times in a single second, can you recognize that blinks? <laughs> Never. That's why any kind of AC appliance runs smoothly. Anyway, that's all the classification of current. See you on next video of basic electronics. Have a nice day.